Hello viewers, today we're in the beautiful city of Edinburgh and we're just at the bottom of York Place where the tram line finishes and we're outside the Conan Doyle pub Sherlock Holmes fans will probably know Arthur Conan Doyle, creator of Sherlock Holmes, was born here literally just born across the road I think, the houses used to be here many years ago but I think that's St George's Church across the road and we've got St Mary's Cathedral well nice building here as well you can see John Lewis in the background that's at the back of the St James's Quarter shopping centre it cost about a billion pounds to build many years we've got another video on the channel showing you that, let's check it out across the road We've got the Omni Centre There's a lot of restaurants and bars in there and there's also a cinema and Just down the road we've got the Edinburgh Playhouse Theatre Let's take a wee wander down We're officially in Broughton Street at the moment As I said, the tram line just finishes just up there around the corner You get the park and ride from the airport or Ingleston that's the very last stop on the tram line. A little bit of information for you. And if you go further down here, on the left, right down the hill, we'll go down towards Leith Walk. Any Hibs fans watching? That's the way you'd head down there, towards Easter Road. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name's Kevin. I do mostly walks, or mostly around Scotland so if you're interested in that sort of thing the good news is, it's absolutely free to subscribe just hit the wee button below the video on the right hand side that says subscribe click the wee bell for all notifications so we head down there, we'll, we'll head down towards Leith Walk and if we go back up this way straight up the wee hill we'll cross over onto Princess Street and on the left is Waterloo Place and as I said there's a new shopping centre the St James's Quarter one of the entrance in a lot of nice high-end designer shops in there there's no pound shops in there and we've got the Omni Centre as I said it's got a lot of restaurants and bars and a cinema If you're going to a show at the Playhouse and you're looking for a nearby hotel where we started to walk from you've got the Hotel Indigo just next to it you've also got the Premier Inn York Place I've stayed in the Premier Inn York Place, it's quite a new one it's actually quite nice I would recommend it and I've got family who have stayed in the Indigo and said it was a really nice hotel as well so there's a couple of hotels that are great locations if you're looking to come to Edinburgh for a show there's a playhouse another really nice building you can do me a wee favour if you're still watching the video give a wee thumbs up it's absolutely free don't forget to subscribe let me know if you've been to a show in the playhouse shot for a long time there but thankfully reopening again another good to tell if you're going to a show at the playhouse if you're looking for a hotel within a one two minute walk just round the corner at Waterloo Place you've got the Travelodge and you've also got the Apex Waterloo Place as well so we've got a couple of hotels just round the corner from here It's quite a good location, you're only 5 minute walk really from Princess Street Ok, so there's a playhouse Please support the shows when they come back The bar next to it, Havana You 
CC Blooms next to it as well. Very windy today in Edinburgh, it's actually very warm, but it's very windy. Okay, so we've got the Theatre Royal Bar. Very popular if you're going for a show next door. So if you look inside. Good news for Terence Lager fans, they sell Terence Lager in there on draft. We've also got the Courtyard Marriott as well. So again, great location if you're going to a show here. I think they're staying in the Courtyard Marriott. So just a short one today. I hope you've enjoyed the walk. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.